I really care nothing about boxing. Boxing is a stepping stone just to introduce me to the audience. But my main fight is for freedom and equality, and this is what I plan to do. So number one comes freedom first for my people, equality, and this is uh, what I plan to do after I'm through fighting. Because as you know, in this country, a black athlete or entertainer has a lot of influence. Some of them promote rescue, some of them make movies, nude scenes with women, and some of them take their fame to promote maybe some type whiskey or some rock and roll record, but I'd like to do all I can <clears throat> to uplift the people morally and spiritually and as far as loving self and sticking together and helping self before um, expecting others to help them and respect them when they don't respect themselves. This is what I want to do. But when one man of popularity can let the world know the problem, he, can, uh, he might lose a few dollars himself telling the truth, might lose his life. But he's helping millions. But if I kept my mouth shut just because I can make millions, and then this ain't doing nothing. So I just love the freedom and the flesh and blood of my people more so than I do the money. Last night, I had a dream. When I got to Africa, I had one hell of a rumble. I had to beat Tarzans behind first for claiming to be the king in the jungle. For this fight, I've wrestled with alligators. I've tussled with a whale. I done handcuffed lightning and put thunder in jail. You know I'm bad. I have murdered a rock. I injured a stone and I hospitalized a brick. I'm so bad, I make medicine sick. I'm so fast, man, I can run through a hurricane and don't get wet. When George Fulmer meets me, he'll pay his debt. I can drown the drink of water and kill a dead tree. Wait till you see Muhammad Ali.